Um, thank you, Samir, um, for giving us this bite. So, firstly, if you can just introduce yourself, that will be great. All right. Um, I am Samir Goel. I am uh, Head of Engineering for Equity Knowledge Partners. Uh, we are a financial services KPO. Um, so, we, we build a lot of fintech products, digital applications and services. Right. Awesome. So, my question to you is, uh, what are the KPIs to, you know, uh, measure the success and gauge the success of a successful DevOps team? See, the first and foremost uh, is the adoption rate, right, of any DevOps process or the tool chain. Um, which means that, you know, if, if it is a, two, a team of 100, for example, how many people are comfortable working with either the process or the tool chain? Um, if the, that KPI is not met, if it is not, you know, above 60, 70 percent, the process as well as the tool chain will essentially fail. Um, the other one is, uh, you know, what is what is the support and for integrations, right, for the ecosystem available? Um, because everybody has a different preference in terms of what tools and technology to use, um, and you know, no matter the vendors, you know, can come up that we have end-to-end -end solutions, but I, for example, as a head of engineering, I will have a preference for a particular tool. Now, if that integration is not possible, I may not be very comfortable, you know, working with a DevOps platform. So integrations available is, is another very important KPI. Awesome. One more question, um, Samir. So what are the kind of innovations that you're bringing in, um, you know, or you think are the way forward uh, in the industry, uh, especially for the fintech? Um, see, the biggest, um, what do you call, um, road ahead for fintech um, in, in terms of, in, in terms of, um, um, you know, how does the industry transforms? Uh, one is to bring in enough security in, in, in the development process. So a lot has been going on around uh, shift left, right? But um, obviously we have made some progress, but I think there is still some work to do because uh, we still have, you know, developers who are afraid of security, for example. So um, instead of keeping security in the realms of CISO and, and you know, the inf information security professionals, we have to probably start addressing that, um, you know, and then make it a part of the developer life cycle rather than, you know, keeping it outside the realms of development pipelines. Because right now, in, in FinTech and across other industries also, um, security is still seen as, you know, something that needs to be done by somebody else, not by a developer. Right. So, so that mindset, obviously, uh, is something which I think a lot of dev DevOps companies and platforms like, you know, JFog and others, they have to address. And I think, you know, um, having workshops, um, having more developer-oriented sessions will help change that. Absolutely. Great insights. Thank, Thank you, you so much, Amir. Just one last one. How was your experience with the event? Uh, it was very nicely done. Uh, I think the agenda was quite clear, crisp. Um, I suppose the timings have been uh, managed very well as well. I think the speakers have been good too. So thank you so much. Great. Thank you so much. Yeah, so Thanks. Okay.